Hello and welcome to Ben's Addiction. If you can remember from a few months ago when I actually bought this Mercedes SL500 R129 with M119 engine, I had this weird problem that when engine is cold, the car runs beautifully and it accelerates beautifully as well without any miss. As you can see, the car just started and it idles perfectly and the idle is now dropping to about 700. And after 5 to 10 minutes of the startup, the car starts missing, backfiring and not accelerating as it should and sometimes hesitates so badly, just like for 3-4 seconds. This is the situation. Just to mention a few of the works I have done on this engine, as far as the maintenance and uh, regular things, I have replaced the spark plugs. I have <clears throat> I have checked my wiring harness, especially the throttle body wiring harness. And as you can see, I have split this uh, section of it and checked inside and all the wirings were beautiful and new. And also the other wiring is beautiful. I couldn't find any single fault on the wiring system of this M119 engine. As you know, 1994 1993 I believe and 1995 these are the years for uh, Mercedes using the biodegradable uh, wiring harnesses for the engine and that's really makes problems most of the time and people have to change the wiring harnesses especially for the throttle body as well as the airflow meter I have also changed all the spark plugs and I have inspected all the spark plug wires as well and they look to be in a decent condition. One more thing that I have done is uh, replacing that CPS. So if that goes bad, you would have the crankshaft sensor, here it is. I have replaced it with a new one and that didn't solve my problem either. I also have checked all the connections for the vacuum lines and things like that by spraying uh, brake parts cleaner uh, to the different sections just like this Y section over here and other uh, vacuum lines and I couldn't find a vacuum leak either. I've also tried to diagnose it by uh, MB Star and other diagnostic tools and I have no light on on my dashboard. No check engine light, nothing like that. I have also cleaned my MAF sensor and I have tested my MAF sensor uh, to realize that my, my MAF sensor, there is nothing wrong with it. Also, as you can see on my channel, I have checked the fuel regulator on my engine as well as a fuel, fuel pressure. So I made sure that these two also work and I get uh, enough and, and constant good few amount of fuel pressure which is around uh, 57 PSI as far as I remember. As you remember, I also have uh, cleaned inside the distributors. Unfortunately, uh, this year, I mean, until 19, uh, 95 M119 engine uses the distributor which uh, most of the time is problematic and you have to change the distributors caps and rotors regularly just and sometimes I have heard in less than 40,000 miles as you remember I have cleaned inside my uh, distributors a few times and there were uh, black debris inside my distributors. I cleaned them, it was awful, but it didn't really work 
very well. I mean, the car can keep up. It doesn't stall. It doesn't do anything really bad to, you know, keep you stranded. But it doesn't really accelerate and it hesitates badly when warms up. And it misses on idle as well after uh, getting warmed up. So today, I have decided to go with the new distributor caps. And to do that, I actually need two of these distributor caps to remove these and see if this will solve my problem. So stay tuned. There are many, many, many complaints about the hesitation missing of M119 engine. So stay tuned and let's have a look. Just to mention the part number of the distributor cap here is 12355224300. The engine is cold, but I, if I rev it a bit... There is no problem revving whatsoever. And the engine is cold. Haven't changed the distributor caps yet. Here I have the old and new distributor cap at the same time for you to have a look. They have the same part number and if you turn them inside is the main difference here. The old one, the shorter electrode in the middle and the conductors, look how black they are on the right hand side with the old one. Okay, my aim is uh, to be able to get uh, close to 8 second acceleration from 0 to 100. Let's do this. 1, 2, 3. I 
think I did it in 8 seconds or something like that. What I feel is the engine smoothness and um, that I have never felt before. So changing the distributor caps definitely has done the job and I feel the smoothness, I feel the acceleration, I don't feel anything weird about this car now. It sounds, feels and goes as it should. Again, I'm back to home. The coolant te temperature is almost 95 degrees or so and this is the hottest I could get and the car runs perfectly. It's very smooth, no vibration, nothing. I I noticed no uh, hesitation. This is now how this engine should be and this is how this car should drive. Guys, thank you so much for watching my videos. Please look at my channel. I have plenty of videos on R129 and all the repairs. Please give me a thumb up and thank you and have a good day. Bye.